Hey there, it's Ta. That was the most stupidest intro I've ever done. Hey guys, Tash here. Thought I would do another haul video because I did mention in my updates that I would do another haul video. I'm going to start off by showing you this swimming costume I bought um, because I didn't get it at Primark or Boohoo. Got it from George, which is Asda's clothes shop. I'm going away on the 3rd of July and I normally wear bikinis but at water parks I like to wear either a swimming costume or a tankini because you know you don't want any of that whole going down a slide and your bikini top flying up because that's just embarrassing. I honestly I see people wearing bikinis at water parks and think how can you do it? Like I would be so paranoid the whole time I'd like sort it out, pulling it across, pulling it down, making sure it's completely covered. I mean I've had times where my tankini top when I'd worn out one to so swimming pool where it flew up in the air and I'm like oh my god if that was a bikini top it had been off. I swear one of my friends once I swear her bikini top came off and came down the slide out behind her. Like why would you put yourself through that? I really love this one. It was out of two. One of them was like purple and had palm trees on it with all like yellow and orange and stuff. And it was more me because it was bright but there was just something about this one. It's, it's rather beautiful. I really love the colours in the water. It's like kind of city pattern. It's very, very pretty. Right. That will be what I'll be wearing at Aqualand. Now I'll go with the accessories first. So as you can see on my head, I got these rather awesome glasses at boohoo.com. Hey. Very cool. They have pearls around them and you could have either all white or um, multicoloured. As you see I got multicoloured because they look so much better. They're really cool, they're kind of funky. Some people would probably be like, whoa, but I don't know. I feel like they look um, great with certain kind of girly outfits, like a blouse or like what I'm wearing now. It's a kind of floral stuff. Also I've decided with these hoes that I'm not going to yabber so much because I do yabber on about crap a lot of the time. So. I'm just gonna kind of get on with it. Primark. Now I um, got two bags. I don't really buy bags a lot. I don't have a lot of bags. I just kind of reuse the same ones over and over. But um, I saw this one at first and I really liked it, but I didn't think to get it. It wasn't until I saw another bag and got that one. And I saw this and I was like, actually, you know what? I'll get this one as well. This one. It's very me, very bright and colourful and Aztec printy. And I like Aztec print and like colours and stuff so it's very nice. Now Amy and Bailey this one's for you because um you know what I'm like with this stuff and I saw this bag and immediately had to get it and uh you will not be surprised once you see it. It's just amazing though. I mean, look at it. Look at it. I would never do that again. Never. Oh, these sunglasses, I forgot to say. If you watched my haul on um, Three Dawson Horse, I um, normally spend one pound on glasses at Primark, and the ones I had actually in that haul were two pound and three pound. These are 10, but the reason why I bought so much on Boohoo is because there was a 30% um, off holiday shop offer going on. So I had a little look around at the holiday shop, and so I really loved these, and I was like, I have to get them. So they were 7, but still, that's still a lot for me for sunglasses, but they were just so amazing, and I wore them quite a lot. So, you know, getting them is worth that one. So these are from Boohoo, and I was waiting for so long to get these, and because of the whole 30% off, I thought, oh, I may as well get them, because it was also 35 no, free delivery when you spend £35, so of course I didn't want to just get them on their own, so I waited until I had loads of stuff to get, so I got 30% off of the holiday shop stuff, which is most of the stuff I got, got, I bought, and then I had £4 off 
of the delivery. These leggings, and once again I will say it, they're very me. Now when I say something is very me, obviously you guys don't know me, you wouldn't understand. For years now, since I was probably about 15, just always wore really bright stuff. I don't as much anymore, but I am very bright. And I would never wear like all black in an outfit. And there's always got to be like at least three colours in my outfit. And I'm just like, wear crazy colours stuff. And I love these because they have the like the leopard print in the background. And then they have these big ass colourful flowers. And like pineapple up here, look. I don't know if you can see it. The pink and white one with the blue at the top. Big pineapple. And then they have cheetahs over them as well. Let me find one. There's a cheetah. See? They're just so cool. I'm so bright. And they're like perfect size as well. Very stretchy. Because I've bought leggings from Boohoo that are perfect. And I've also bought leggings from Boohoo that are like those ones you know that are have a really short crotch so that they're kind of down too low and you want to pull them up. But if you pull them up anymore, they'll go right, you know, up here. I've said too much. Con lo terrorista. They do the Harlem shake. did that. But yeah, I found Primark, I have this Harlem Shake top. Not that I'm like really crazy obsessed with the Harlem Shake, I mean I don't exactly care for the song and I didn't even make my own Harlem Shake video and I wasn't like obsessed with them and people probably like, oh it's old now. But it bugs me when people are like that because it's like if you like it, you like it. Doesn't matter whether it's old or not, just because there's some people that will like things when they're new and then they'll go off of them. Other people will still like them, like Gangnam Style for example. People are like, oh that's old now, nah, nah. It's a song. I'm still obsessed with Super Love. I'm still obsessed with Love You Like Another Song and that was out in June 2011. Now, why is Gangnam Style going to be any different? Just because it was a viral video isn't going to make any difference. I still love it, okay? I mean, the reason I love that Gangnam Style is the dance. And I love, oh well, I don't love the Harlem Shake, but I like the Harlem Shake because it's just fun, you know? I don't find them funny. People seem to be like, think they've got to be funny. To me, they just look fun. And I want to make one. Kind of casual and big and look nice with a pair of denim shorts or leggings. This. I love this. First I was like, oh my god, I love that. And then my friend, Winzy, she was all like, get it then. And I was like, oh no, I'm not going to get it. I just said that I like it. And but then I was actually thinking, I was like, oh, hang on a second. It is quite amazing. What's this? So cute. Look at the bright ass colours. I love it. Once again, like I said, it's very me. <laughs> the thing is, I'm obsessed with crop tops. I have so many crop tops, but like, I'm not exactly very skinny. Because I kind of look like I'm a skinny person with my thin arms. I have tiny ass wrists. But I'm very big on the hips and the stomach and the thighs. I don't really care that much about my thighs, it's more my hips and my stomach because they stick out and it looks so attractive. So, but actually if I wore this with like high waisted shorts, it actually looks really nice. And I actually look slim. I can hear monk. Oh, it started again. This I got from Primark and I actually wore it when I went to Weston Super Mare for my vacation song music video. And it's very nice. I like kind of blousey thing. I like the heart detail on shoulder and collar. And it's kind of see through. It's Hello. Is that scary? 
It isn't it. I'm a 19 year old woman, what am I doing? I wore it with one of those like, those quote bandeau tops. I wanted a maxi skirt for a while. I wanted just a plain pink one. The one I wanted was not in stock and it's my size. So instead I decided to get this one instead. But I actually want one with a cut out of the side because I felt like it flow better when you walk. So I got this one. So there's the top of it and it has like this at the side where it's scrunched up and then there's like a split down the side so it kind of goes. Is that the bottom of it either? there? There's the bottom of it. Because it's got the split on the side and it's really nice. This is one of the items I actually bought, not last time I went to Primark but time for. It was only a fiver. Lovely play suit. There's the bottom of it. Haven't worn it yet. I'm taking this one on holiday. But I just really love it. It's really simple yet funky and cheap as well. And it's just, you know, nice for hot sunny days. Five pounds though, you can't go wrong with five fucking pounds. I had to get a swear word in there, didn't I? It's my last item now and it's actually also from Primark and it's also five pounds because they have a lot of this kind of thing for five pounds. This wonderful dress. It's really, this one's really basic, just simple with the spots. It's really cute and it looks nice with like a denim jacket and stuff. And on the bottom, the nice little skater dress, I guess it is, isn't it? Like, not really bad with like fashion y stuff. It's so cute because for a fiver, it didn't even really matter if you just wore it once because it's only a fiver, you know? That's today's outfit. Went to college today. Yeah, so I know there wasn't much today and. Sounds I feel like the calls are kind of like just me going, this is what I got, it's lovely. This is another thing I got, it's lovely, it's very me. But you know, people like looking at clothes, like I said. I mean, I watched Graveyard Girl's 20 minute video of her shoe collection. Shoes. I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you around. Bye.